thank you very much. Uh, There's a microphone. Okay. Um, thank you very much for inviting us. Uh, thank you very much for inviting us. Um, thank you to Liv, uh, to the great people from the chef group that I met uh, a year ago, uh, and really inspired me, you know, as part of the project that uh, the Toronto Animated Image Society created. Um, <coughs> It, uh, first of all, I want to introduce myself. I'm Maddie Piller, I'm volunteer president of the Toronto Animated Image Society. The Toronto Animated Image Society, most, mostly named TAIS or TAIS, um, it's an arts organization <coughs> supported by the Canada Council for the Arts and we have uh, also granting from the Toronto Arts Council and the Ontario Arts Council to create projects. Um, and uh, we have also a space uh, that uh, has different uh, animation tools uh, and we give access to independent artists to use equipment and create work. Um, so uh, in that line, a year ago, we created a project that was called Hello Amiga. Um, Hello Amiga started uh, because uh, at TAIS we had uh, over the years some equipment donated and uh, the equipment was uh, old equipment, Amiga. Everybody wanted to put it in the garbage. I hold on to the equipment and I decided that it was now the good time to actually create a project with these Amiga computers. Um, so uh, we invited a group of artists, Canadian artists, to um, create uh, animation using the equipment or using the emulators. Um, the idea was uh, to resurface the old technology. And um, with that sense, we invited uh, um, different artists. Um, their name uh, here, Daniel Barrow, Barry Dupay, Alex McLeod, Amy Locker, Lorna Mills, and Mark Pellegrino. Um, these artists are, um, are users of old technology. They're animators or visual artists media artists using oral technology or using also uh, animation uh, ways for creating uh, their work. Um, so, um, yeah, the Hello Amiga was created and uh, we invited these artists to do, uh, to do new work and uh, to challenge actually the aspects of, uh, of uh, the use of old technologies. Um, today, um, we're going to have uh, one of the films shown uh, by Mark Pellegrino. It's a 20 minute show. Um, these are, I'm going to show a little bit of uh, the artwork that was created by this artist. Uh, this is Alex McLeod, um, Amy Locker. That's also by Amy Locker. Uh, Lorna Mills. She's a a video artist and she uses collage um, animations um, and she creates a lot of GIF uh, work. Daniel, Daniel Barrow, also Daniel Barrow. Mm, Barry Dupé, yeah, and uh, that's also an image from Barry Dupé and uh, the last one. Mark Pellegrino. Mark Pellegrino. So, um, the Hello Amiga can be seen, you know, in an exhibition in a gallery at uh, Trinity Square Video. That's in um, 401 Richmond in downtown Toronto. Uh, it's going to be up to uh, December 15. Uh, we're going to have a couple of workshops also going on on December 18 on how to, you know, use the Amigas and uh, how to use the emulators. Uh, Mark is going to be one of the instructors uh, along with uh, Alex McLeod, how he actually worked 
his uh, his work. So I encourage you to to go to the gallery, or if you are really interested in getting into the the world of uh, working again with amigas, um, this uh, artist and especially Mark has worked extensively with uh, with the Amiga emulators, and he's going to be doing some uh, some uh, demo of uh, how to you know set up the, the emulators and everything. Um, so, um, um, I think that's it for the my part. Uh, I'd like to introduce Mark. Mark is a you know media artist, and he works with uh, really old technology, and he's very interested in prolonging that uh, technology into this new uh, uh, media uh, world. So um, I think he can explain more about his work and, and show his film. Thank you very much. We we'll, we'll can have like a Q and A after the the show. Thank you. Thanks, everybody. Um, so you know, Betty was. Uh, thanks for having me here. This is really incredible to get to show the work here. Um, uh, so, and of course, thanks to Teus for putting this together. It's a really incredible show. Uh, I'd encourage you all to go see it. Some of the artists did incredible jobs. Um, uh, almost everybody stuck with Deluxe Paint, which I just got my first copy of right now, my first legit copy of Deluxe Paint. I got three versions, I think, for around 30 cents, something like that, so it's worth the deal. I don't think EA is going to see any of that money, though. Um, <laughs> Are they still around? I think they're doing okay. um, So I'm going to show the film. Um, it's uh, all done in deluxe paint. There's a little early Lightwave 3D version, one Lightwave 3D in there. Uh, it was all done on the Wing UAE emulator. We had real Amiga set up in the studio, but I actually chose to do it on the emulator so I could kind of live video capture myself working with the software and it kind of expands what you can do. And it also obviously speeds up the workflow a whole lot in terms of uh, getting it done by the deadline. So um, I should also mention it's got some you know, graphic ASCII art depictions and some, and some suggestive sexual content, but nothing too bad, it's all fun stuff. Okay, uh, enjoy everybody, thanks for uh, watching. <laughs> <laughs>